The church is at its best when it's working as an instrument of good in the world. And this year, that has meant serving here in Jacksboro as we begin to tackle long-term recovery efforts and help our neighbors rebuild in the wake of March's destructive tornadoes. It has been six months since those tornadoes ripped through town, damaging homes, businesses, and the local schools. The Center for Missional Outreach and UMCOR have already played a significant role in getting the recovery efforts underway. But we know that this work is not short term. It will continue for months and even years to come. That is why I'm challenging all the churches of the North Texas Conference in participating in Close to Home. It is our campaign, our effort, our missional response to what has happened in this disaster in Jack County. In all, we anticipate that this effort is going to require over $2 million. But we have other partners, and I do want you to know that. But it is my hope that our one-time gifts through this campaign can raise one quarter of that, $500,000, over the next two-year period. So I'm inviting each of you to think about how you can be helpful in terms of that effort. In Paul's second letter to the Corinthians in the eighth chapter, Paul praises the church in Corinth for their generosity. He also asks of them something else. And not only did he ask it of them, I believe it's God's way of asking it of us, even in this present time. And so listen to what it is that Paul says. Now, as you excel in everything, in faith, in speech, in knowledge, in utmost eagerness, and in our love for you, so we want you to excel also in this generous undertaking. Will you prayerfully consider how you can respond to this ask? How it is that you can be generous? Joan and I are going to be very generous in a gift that we will make before the end of the year. And I believe that over the next couple of years, each person in the North Texas Conference, each church in the North Texas Conference, can engage in this generous undertaking to help our neighbors in Jack County. Thank you for that consideration.